The special theory of relativity was developed by Albert Einstein in the spring of 1905 in the space of a, perhaps five intense weeks of thought where he rewrote our understanding of space and time. Newton had given us an understanding of space and time back in the late 1600s, which is very intuitive. It's the way we all think about space and time. Here is space, it's just this environment where things happen, and time is this relentless thing that ticks forward on our watches, our clocks, taking us moment after moment, second after second, into the future in a completely uniform, absolute, and unchanging way. In special relativity, Einstein said, that's not right. He said, space and time can change depending upon how you move. He showed that if you're moving relative to somebody else, time for you slows down. And these kinds of revolutionary ideas are not simply esoteric, pen and paper type understandings of the universe. You can take a little particle called a muon, which if it's sitting in front of you, will self-destruct in about a millionth of a second, it'll fall apart. You take that particle and you make it go fast in one of these particle accelerators. It zips around near the speed of light. Because it's moving, time for it slows down. It doesn't just live for a millionth of a second. It lives for a second or longer, a million times longer than it would if it was sitting in front of you. If you could put a person in one of these accelerators, they wouldn't live 80 years. They might live 80 million years as we're watching them because time for them slows down.